Welcome back, you guys. This is Tessindra, continuing my CK2 campaign as the Kingdom of Bohemia, which is weird because it's not the title of the series, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm actually debating about just releasing this guy, making him independent, because I was trying to get into Bavaria and just things went horribly wrong. Uh, these two dudes became part of Poland for getting occupied by whom? This dude over here. He is trying to subjugate them. And he's winning. Maybe we could be quick and just take some of this stuff out. Like, if I take Passau quickly, maybe we could get it done? I mean, we're not right next to this province. Let's just see if we can get it done. Like, grab these two back, or at least one of them, and uh, we'll try to continue moving towards Bavaria here. But the thing is, my guy is getting really, really old, and I'm kind of debating if I should actually just... Uh, give my kingdoms away right now, or if I w should wait until I die. The thing is, though, um, this kid here, my son, who is nine years old, he's going to inherit Pomerania and Saxony. And my other son, this guy here, my grandson, he has got a duchy over here, and he's going to become my heir. He's gonna take over Bohemia. Ah, that's uh, that's annoying to say the least. But should I do it? Should I actually give away a kingdom title? That seems very very dramatic. If I were to revoke Altmark from you, because I kind of want to fix up this kingdom over here. Um, I'm debating this. I am debating this. Thing is, if I die, I'll get it back, so it's fine. But, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna have to take this away from you. I'm sorry, man. It's gonna piss off some of my vassals, but it's fine. I'm gonna grant you Altmark. There we go. So at least it looks sort of intact. You own this. You own that. I can... Uh, yeah, I could still create title over here, right? Yes. You hold this. You are the duke of this terrain. Ah, should I just do this? Kingdom of Pomerania. Ah, things could go wrong. Who is over here that belongs to me here? I have a son that's four. Things could go wrong if he inherits this early, though. My grandson, if I were to give him the kingdom title. Uh, I just know things are going to go horribly wrong once I die. Because I have Gavelkind. I know things are going to go wrong. I know that I also have a war going on right now, but you know. Gotta prioritize here. Um, I'm also thinking about ditching this guy, because he's just going to be an issue, isn't he? Let's see here. Uh, Saxony is... Yeah, he does not own anything in Saxony. Can I grant you independence? Duke Robert must be at peace. Okay. What are you at war with here? Somebody's trying to take Kent away from you. What? Defending against... Oh, he's trying to take Kent. Yeah, he's starting to go to war to with stuff over here in England. And I just am not interested in that in the least. Uh, I received a request for additional funds from my spy master. He is worried that it's too easy for spies to make their way inside your home and wants to take precautionary measures against hostile operations. Uh, usually this ends badly. You know, who knows? Maybe it will be fine. I'm thinking actually considering ditching this guy here. Just getting rid of this. He is in a kingdom over here that is... Oh, come on. This is Frisia. The kingdom of Frisia. I could actually make another kingdom over here. If I conquer enough of this. 
but I think I'm overreaching a bit. I'll wait until he's at peace and then just, you know, give it away. But then again, if I give you Kingdom of Saxony, then you will be fine. I still have this guy here and I can release him later. There we go. So. Can we be allies? Yes. It's very important that we stay allies so I can defend you if anything goes wrong. Rumors have reached you that people are conspiring to kill you. Well, yeah, that happens. And then you become the king of Pomerania. There we go. Okay, so. <laughs> this could go horribly wrong. Um, but, let's see here. My son is now the king of Saxony. And my other son is now the king of Pomerania. And now I can form alliances with you. In case something goes horribly, horribly wrong. But everything looks fine now. Apart from, like, Rostock over here. But maybe he can handle that himself. I'm just so worried that when I die, it's gonna happen anyway. And if I can do this right now... Uh, under my terms, maybe it's better? I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to see what happens. I just hope nobody crazy decides to attack my sons before they are of age. If I lose it, I'll grab it back. But I have a really strong power base in Bohemia. I own all of Bohemia. Every single province, it's mine. Now, when I die, I lose these three things. I'll lose this tiny duchy over here. And it will go to this sun up here. Yeah. Let's see here. High Chieftain of Moravia. Yeah, I can't change that. I can just nominate who's gonna success, su succeed me. Yeah, that was difficult. Oh, you're wounded and a lunatic. Oh, goody. So my heir is this guy over here. Yeah, he was the strong one. But I did not like his wife. His wife was garbage. She's also looking really, really fat. Oh, she's gluttonous. She is brawny, you know, but still. I would have picked somebody better. But it's fine. So you're going to love me for a very, very long time, aren't you? Granted a kingdom, so you're going to like me for ten years. That's it? I'm not going to live that long, but it's fine. Okay, so my dynasty is mostly secure in these three kingdoms. Uh, we're going to hopefully just spread out as much as we can. And once we have created an empire or something along those lines, look at Prussia. We can probably try to consolidate a bit more. Yes, I'm going to train my dog personally. Queen Mila the Brute of Prussia. She's got six sons. Well, five. Damn, woman. Oh, she is. Oh, she's probably leader of the uh, the cold ones, isn't she? I can join the assassins. Why? <laughs> I can become one of the assassins. <laughs> oh, I still have cancer. Crap. That's not good. Spy master. We have my niece and my friend and court tutor. She's also a lunatic and has the great pox. You have the fever and the chest pains. But you really, really like me. You're my friend. Let's just have you there and hopefully you live long enough so that I die before you do. Uh, designated regent. Um, anybody who is content, who's not going to try to do anything nasty, sure, you can do that. Uh, cup bearer. You. Oh. My steward died. All right, that's not good. Uh, we have two powerful vassals that I would kind of like to get rid of. They're not really good, are they? All right, let's put it on speed four and try to finish off this war that I started a long time ago. All right, so that is, uh, that is that. Let's go ahead and take this, and then we can probably have to, we'll probably have to find some Polish troops to kill. 
My little son, Gerhardt, is the king of Saxony, has sought you out with a dead bird cradled in his arms. With a concerned look on his face, Gerhardt asks you what happened to the animal. Why is she not flying anymore? So... The bird is it. The bird is in with Veles now. That's a weird way to phrase that. So, he could become an idolizer and he could become indolent. Uh, I don't... Do I want to become kind? Intrigue goes down. That's my bread and butter. Cruel gives me intrigue. Hurts my diplomacy, though. I'm just not gonna do that. Just go away. Go away. Uh, a man is brought in shackles before you. Apparently he is a missionary from Pickland, from Scotland. Ah. I can make him my court physician. I don't have anybody else. Uh, no. Burn him. Let's just invite some holy men to court. Let's auto assign commanders. And let's see. Invite hol holy men to court. There we go. When this pops up, I know he's good enough to be a doctor. Good. So, give me under a title of court physician. Thank you. You are good enough to be my doctor. My incompetent steward, who's got 13 stewardship, has let smugglers into the county of Rade. I don't know where that is. Ooh. I gained plus one health thanks to my dog. Thank you, dog. I'm going to live for a while, aren't I? My spouse is the Witch Queen of Bohemia. That is interesting. That's an interesting title, wife. Alright. Yeah, I named him Veles after my god, which is weird. <laughs> oh, I lost my steward as well. Well, no longer. No wonder he's incompetent. He's dead. Uh, it's, why didn't you like me more? Revoked vassal titles. Yeah, I know. I know. I had to. You're not that good. Um, what about if I just invite a noble to court? He's got 15 stewardship. Oh, it makes him better than you. When you invite a noble to court, they're usually good at stewardship. If you invite a holy man, he's good at learning. And uh, if you promote a commander, he's going to have some martial. But if you want a good diplomat or a good spy master, you have to just find those people individually. Grand Chief of Poland has called in some dude. Yeah, he called in one of his guys on this war. It's fine. What's happening here? Defending against subjugation war? Why did you not call me in, son? Offer to join war? What? Oh, come on! We gotta end this war quickly. Alright. You bastard, you're attacking my son. Why did you not tell me? What's going on here? Holy war for Saxony. Uh, why can't I not join these wars? Am I gonna lose my kingdoms now because my sons can't defend it? Uh, Barbour reacts to cynical comments. My chancellor. He doesn't like cynicism? No, he doesn't like cynicism. Who the fuck cares? I'm trying to defend my sons here. Okay, come on. Oh, you got a thousand dudes there? Really? How close are you to losing this? 6%. Attacking. Against what? Oh, you're allied to the Duke. Ah, uh, no. Uh, for some reason, the clicks are no longer coming here. Attacking Grand Chief Ludric of Poland in Bohemian Conquest of Passau. Oh, he's helping me. Right, right. And you are getting attacked by a holy war, and you're attacking... Yeah, you're helping me in my war. Okay. Okay. For some reason, CK2 seems to bug out sometimes with the, with the, uh, the sounds, and that's annoying. And it looks like you kicked him out. Army of my son. Yeah, he's got some nice troops. Good job. Good job. 
Yeah, my son is here and my... No, my son is here my grandson is here, I think. No, they're both my sons. Weird. Okay, it looks like they might be able to do this on their own. But I think I'm stuck at 99 because I don't have anyone to fight anywhere. Let's try to find some Polish dudes so we can fight and end our war here. Anybody. I just need to find somebody to fight. You completely conquered. Holy shit. Do you have any troops? He's got like 400 troops somewhere. Where are they? I'm stuck at 99 war score because I can't find any troops of yours to fight. My vassal, the Duke of Gelray. Oh, you just usurped a bunch of shit. Yeah, he's got he's getting more land in England. We have three provinces now in England. Ah, maybe we should just keep that. Uh oh yeah, we could ally ourselves with Croatia again. Are you at war? A holy war. Oh, you that's why you want an alliance. You're getting attacked by the Byzantines. Nope, let's fuck off. Not interested not interested at all. Is there anything we can do with money right now? Um for some reason the inst the like the tech spread is not really working out that great over here. Yeah. Chance per year to increase. Ah, that's horrible. Is there no way to increase the tax spread? No, I'm still tribal. God damn it. I can't spend this money on anything. Uh, yeah, we did have some tech over here, didn't we? Oh yeah, but we don't have this. Alright, fine. So I can't find any Polish troops to kill. Uh, there is no woman better at increasing the church's opinion of me or teach me to become a more pious ma man than my diviner. Yeah, sure. The prosperity of my capital increases slightly. Yeah, we're getting attrition over here. I'll just, you know, I'm just gonna disband my troops and we'll wait. I'll just sit on my hands until Poland decides to stop. Oh wait, there's something we can do over here. We can siege that down. Ah, let's go to speed 4. So you're getting attacked, and it looks like you're winning this. Yeah, you have some good dupes and barons to help you there. That's fine. You have a peasant revolt. My daughter was born to a random courtier of mine. I don't know why I would care. But, um... Ah. Defend 52% in favor of King Ivar, son of Fenrir. Son of the devil. Really? He's winning this? I don't like that. 100%. Enforce demands. Alright, so we have wrong type of holding. Yes, I accept. Dangerous faction. Independence. This dude wants independence. I don't want him. Yeah, fuck off. Have your independence. I accept. Wrong type of holding. Yeah, that's right. It's a, it's a castle, isn't it? I'll give you Pasal. Alright. Everybody get over here. Band and re raise. Alright, we need to kill a lot of dudes here. Let's call on some uh, tribal armies. Because we're almost gonna be dead soon, so it's fine. Our prestige is gonna go away when we die. Yep, take this. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and help you because it looks like you're dead. Really, really losing here. Kill this. Get in there, get in there, get in there. Thank you. That's gonna turn the war score around a lot. Alright, let's uh... We're not in charge of this, so we can't siege him down. Alright. 
What is this? We can arrest people? My daughter, what is she doing? She's trying to kill my niece. Can you stop. Don't do that. My spy master died. That's a shocker. Ah, you're craven. Yeah, it's fine. You like me. He's ha he has a positive opinion of me, so that's all I really need. What happens? He died in battle. Who owns this now? My grandson. Okay, so the dude... My grandson over here in Volgast, who is my heir, now inherited all this. And he's also stressed. Ah, this is not good. I'm losing my kin to battles because we're getting attacked by our neighbors. But it's fine. No, 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 no. Let's go ahead and kill this. This holy war has to stop as well. Huh? Come on, get in there. No, 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 let's not attack a... That's across the river, I don't want to do that. And then get up there. Die! Attack this, we're up... Yeah, we're actually winning now, so that's fine. The holy war is going well in our favor. Capture somebody. Burn it down. Go ahead and take you on. Okay, Praha prospers. That's my capital. It's got flourishing. Nice. Oh, I died. Whoops. Well, it looks like I got Pomerania back then. King Rotislav of Pomerania. King Rotislav of Pomerania. Uh, what the fuck just happened? Oh, right. I got this stuff up here, didn't I? Whoops. So when I died, I actually took a whole duchy away from my, uh, my other son over here. And I did lose this. You went independent. No, this actually passed to you. You made my borders worse. <laughs> you made them look even worse. You bastard. You absolute bastard. Vassal levies? Why do you raise vassal levies? Come back. Alright. Alright, alright. So we did lose a single province over here to my uncle here. Form alliance? Nah, he's a title claimant. He doesn't like me, does he? Nah, alright. It's fine. We can consolidate. We can consolidate and make this work fine. We're going to Altmark. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and kill you. But Saxony looks like it's actually in one piece. But Pomerania is uh, effed. Heavily effed. Alright. So let's group up all of our dudes. The main is too big. Right. Um. There's no way I can give this land to you, is there? No. Form alliance? Yes. He's willing to accept an alliance, so the king of Saxony is fine. But this dude, he's got a claim on me. Yeah, he's got a claim on Bohemia. Oh boy. Interesting, interesting. What is this war over here? Mecklenburgian conquest of Poznan. Really? Alright, so we're doing three wars right now. That is just peachy. We're winning the Holy War, which is uh, important. Let's go to Schleswig and siege that down. What do you have? You have no troops. What do you have? No troops at all. Poland? Nothing. None of you have any troops. So we're winning this quite easily. But uh, let's see here. We're gonna fix our council as well. You don't like me. Why is that? Short reign and my demand is too big. You're also kind of banned for this position. Why do I just have two... I have two... Uh, shamans in control over here. My kinswoman. You actually like me. Um, you've got 10, 10, and 12. You've got... Okay. Let's uh, change you to be my uh, diviner. 
Okay. Anybody better? Not really. Okay, so we'll settle for you there. You've got some martial, but you are just... A horrible... St yeah, you know. Your stats are horrible. Stewards. Let's have you. Spy master. I'm gonna have you. Yeah, my spy master's not good. My council, all in all, is not that great. Yeah, this is my uh, capital. Yeah, but we have some territory up here. Ah, that's annoying. Ambition. It's become exalted amongst men. My vassal levies will go away. My domain size is too small. I have hunting focus on right now. Let's go rulership to fix my domain size. Yeah, there we go. Successor nomination. High chief of Pomerania. Pomerania. Huh. That's this guy. No, this guy. I want you to inherit. Yeah, so this is King Rostislav. Yes. I'll try to unite Pomerania and Bohemia back into one thing. To fix these borders for once. Let's call you in here. Let's call in all of our allies on all of our wars. What do we have here? Regent. None of you like me. The short reign penalty is horrible. Yeah, there we go. This guy is content and he's my steward, so that's fine. The Holy War looks like it's almost about to be finished here. My wife is pregnant. My fat, ugly wife. Beautiful. Ah, okay. Siege of the Slesvig tribe. Do I have to siege everything that Denmark owns? That's too much, man. It's way too much. But the thing is, I care about all three of these kingdoms. They're all in my dynasty, and I don't want them to leave it. Not at all. What is this? Who do you belong to? Attacking in a subjugation war. What? The, this duke that I granted independence is trying to subjugate him. Oh, you don't stand a chance. Let's go ahead and kill you. Okay, fine. We'll go here. He's coming back to Plodden. There we go. Okay. So we're going to take this back, and I think the Holy War will be done for the most part when this is over. Why did you want to go after Poznan? I don't know. I don't understand that. 96. Take it back. 100%. Oh, I'm not the war leader. But this is fine. So, peace out. So, we're going to win the Holy War. And you're going to get a lot of cash out of this. Come on. Win the Holy War. Oh, he got a lot of cash, didn't he? Winning these Holy Wars against the Catholics. It's really, really good. It's, it's, I highly recommend that. All right. So we're at war with Poland, and we're at war with Shyland. Denmark, basically. Um, what do we want to siege down over here? We got this one covered. Uh, you're already getting sieged by somebody else. By me. All of this has been sieged by me, or? No. Only your capital. You're trying to subjugate him, aren't you? 66% in your favor. Interesting. Well, Poland is not an issue. They're getting creamed by some other people here. I'm gonna dismiss my troops, I think. Or... Like, Denmark stretches so far, and they're also had... Oh, what happened? They took this back. This belonged to Denmark at some point, so that's been fixed. That's good. It was weird to see Denmark down in province. Uh, yeah... The only thing we can siege down is this province in uh, Lubus. Let's just do that, and then we can take this one here as well. Niederbayern. You inherited this from somebody? Alright. Salzburg. Alright, it's fine. I have a son. That's gonna mess up my succession. 
Oh yeah, we have a lot of sons, don't we? No, we have one son, but we have a lot of siblings. My half-brother is not landed. Uh, wait, do I have too many held titles? No, I don't. Who is the chief of this place? I am. Who is the Duke of Morovia? You are? Why? I have two of these provinces. Why did you get that, you bastard? So what we could do, I'm going to take my sibling here. I'm going to grant you... Oh, I can't do that while I'm at war? Or are you not at my court? You're not at my court. All right, once you are of age, I can give you Rana and make you the Duke of Mecklenburg. Then. Or Oboretria. That should work out fine. Let's go down here and take this. All of these wars happened because my dude died. But, you know, it, it's gonna happen. Gavelkind is a bitch. But I'm hoping that we can, you know, keep our uh, three kingdoms here. We can't form an empire from these kingdoms. Like, Saxony is not a part of this. They're a part of Germania here. So there are four kingdoms within Germania. And we have Saxony and Bohemia. Bavaria we were working on, but Germany is way too big and not under our control. And there's no way to form it without it. Because we need 80% to form this empire here. Oh well. I lost my marshal? I guess... No. No, 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 no. I'm not going to guess anything. You're not invited to be a part of my council because you are a bastard. We can't see this down. Oh, this the war is over. It ended inconclusively. Okay, that's fine. So, right now, the only war we're doing is the war against uh, Shyland. They tried to subjugate us. And we cannot allow Pomerania to fall to Denmark. Fuck those guys. But unfortunately, guys, we are out of time. So, uh, it looks kind of hectic at the moment, but we still have a really powerful... Uh, base. We have Bohemia completely locked down, except one province that went to my uncle. But we have 1400 ducats. We are ridiculously rich, and for a tribe, that is really rare. And uh, we could start spending some of this cash, kinda. I don't want to spend it on this. But um, we could hire mercenaries and go to some really, really big wars with this money. And see how that goes. But anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then, see ya. And thanks for watching.